Good evening, I'm Glenn Rinker, News Watch 10. While Miami continues to swelter in a record winter heat wave, bringing temperatures to the mid and upper 90s, the central and Rocky Mountain states are buried in snow. In Colorado, 10 inches of snow has fallen in just a few hours tonight. Travel in the Rockies is almost impossible. Airports are shut down, stranding thousands of passengers. Highways are blocked by snow drifts. Railroad tracks are frozen. Officials in Colorado tell Newswatch at least three people have been killed by exposure to freezing winds. The governor of Colorado is expected tomorrow to declare a weather emergency. The National Guard might be called out to clear streets and roads. Weather forecasters predict more snow and heavy winds tonight and tomorrow, with temperatures dropping well below zero. Back here in South Florida, we've got just the opposite problem. The heat and humidity are supposed to climb. Local beaches should be jammed. Our weather expert, Walter Thronice, will have the local forecast later on this watch. The Miami City Commission today has put on this bill for $8 million for every year. Good evening, I'm Glenn Rinker, News Watch 10. While Miami continues to swelter in a record winter heat wave, bringing temperatures to the mid and upper 90s, the central and Rocky Mountain states are buried in snow. In Colorado, 10 inches of snow has fallen in just a few hours tonight. Travel in the Rockies is almost... <laughs> Airports are shut down, stranding thousands of passengers. Highways are blocked by snow drifts. Railroad tracks are frozen. Officials in Colorado tell Newswatch at least three people have been killed by exposure to freezing winds. 